morning tonight for anyone living in Harper Woods or any of the gross points tonight. Police are investigating a rash of burglaries in that area and what the crook took away with uh, what he took away today is nothing short of heartbreaking. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell joins us now live in Gross Point Woods with more. So, Kim, what happened? I'm live outside the Gross Point Woods Police Department, and investigators here, they'll tell you, most of the time during break-ins, burglars take things like TVs, jewelry, other high-ticket items. But what they took today, more valuable than any such item. This is what Ken Baja's mom found when she stopped by he and his wife Laura's Gross Point Woods house in the middle of the day. She had noticed that this was all tore up here. Someone had kicked in the door and ransacked the house. My wife's jewelry upstairs was taken, TV upstairs was taken, TV downstairs was taken. But that was nothing. He can't ask for help when he's somewhere else. So I'm just asking for help for him. Laura Baja is asking for your help finding this beloved little Yorkie taken in his kennel by criminals. His name is Oliver. I just hope whoever does have him isn't hurting him because he's just so small and he's so young. He's not even a year. And I just hope nobody's hurting him. Oliver's just, he's like my little baby. I've had him for, he was an orphan and we rescued him. And I just, I just really want him back. The couple has collected money for a reward. They say tips can be anonymous. I don't care about the material items, just uh, we'd love to have our dog back. Leave him on the doorstep, leave him in the backyard, I don't care. Just bring him back. The Bachas say if you know where Oliver is, if you think you've seen him, if someone suddenly today has a dog that looks like him, you can call them, you can call police, you can call Action News, no questions asked, they don't care who you are, you can be anonymous. They just want Oliver back. Their family is not whole without him. Reporting live in Gross Point Woods, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.